Hello friends, how are you? So now this is the weekly update of the great thousand piece puzzle. One thousand pieces of jigsaw puzzle. So, so far I have done uh, this part, this blue, blackish and all those similar shade part. I'm trying to make sense of it and now finally I could actually connect so much of it. I'm feeling so awesome. I took about two hours maybe yeah <laughs> for just this much you know what happened actually this part and this whole part became in four hours after that the other parts are taking a lot of time because you can see what do you see the same color but anyways it's my determination that I am going to do this puzzle and that's what is gonna happen no matter what this is gonna happen this puzzle is going to get completed now the only challenge is I have to get this completed <laughs> by morning. I have to close this puzzle and pack it up. So what I've done so far, I'll just explain. You have to uh, sort the pieces by shape without without any pointers, with one pointer, with two pointers on the either side, with a pointer on two sides and two sides diagonal having no, no pointers and then with three pointers and then with four pointers so that is the way that this puzzle goes any 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 puzzle goes in this way so you have to be arranging it that is the most efficient way to solve complex and very big puzzles that is one of the tips that i'll give you and i'm sure you have heard about these tips before but let me just run through some of those because you are into jigsaw puzzling or if you have not heard these tips uh, so these are first time for you so you can use this these tips if you are trying out for a 350 or 500 piece puzzle for the first time i know most people don't so you can try doing a 500 piece puzzle i think it will be done by five, four to six hours by any normal person and if you're really smart you want to challenge yeah i can do it much faster so let's do a race i would suggest uh, because these puzzles might look simple because it's a game but it's not that simple <laughs> The one good thing about this puzzle is that the shapes are unique. So over here specifically, because you can see the color is totally the same, but because of the shape cutting, I'll just show you a close up the cuttings. Do you see this cutting? It is a unique cut. This is a unique cut and this is a unique cut. So even if some, the color is same, but the cut is so different even within uh, one section of the cut piece the cuts are very unique so that's a good thing about this puzzle which also gives clues so you have to take clues not only from the photograph the image of the puzzle but also the shapes also the shape type and the shape types have a little difference so that is a clue that the manufacturer is giving us so the, the the developer or the creator of this puzzle has thought it through so that's a very good thing so that's it for today and hopefully i complete this this is vlog 3 of solving giant puzzles 1000 piece puzzle have a great day guys have fun